I'm here with Coach Cohen, and you guys just got back from a seven-game road trip, first leg in Cancun, Mexico. How was that? Uh, it, was, uh, it was terrific. It, you know, it's a great experience for our kids. Uh, we, get, we get to uh, see a different part of the world and compete against some great competition. And, uh, you know, it's really great for team bonding to spend that time on the road. And the first game, you guys didn't get off the start, I'm sure you'd hoped. But then you guys, had back, you guys secured back-to-back -back wins after that. When did you change the momentum? Well, I think, uh, you, you know, when you go on those tournaments, uh, you know, sometimes the first game you, you, you're a little bit uh, anxious and so on. We didn't play our best game against St. Louis. They shot the ball extremely well. And then we bounced back against a very good East Tennessee State team, and, uh, and we shot the ball well. We got a lot more comfortable in that environment and started playing better basketball. Absolutely. And you guys had four players score double points against Texas State? Texas State was an exciting game. We got down uh, late uh, in the second half. You know, I think the team showed great resolve in coming back and, and securing the victory. Yeah, what were the keys to those victories? I think it was our energy level on the defensive end. Uh, we really guarded uh, pretty well, maybe the best portion of the year uh, of our young season. We, we played pretty well on the defensive end. Then we shared the basketball on the offensive end, and we had guys step up uh, like Jonathan Lee and Ryan Pearson had a great tournament, and of course Chase Allen. Now moving on, you guys had two more games in Orlando, two in Virginia, and then one back here at Matthews Arena. What do you think you can learn from those games moving on? Well, I think the injuries started to take take their toll on us. I mean, Chase Allen's been battling some injuries all year long, and he fought through uh, the Cancun tournament, and then we got up to Orlando and just really wasn't feeling right. We gave a valiant effort against Princeton. We came two points short in that game, but uh, yeah, you know we just weren't the same basketball team. But we're looking to, to, to settle down into a rotation and guys kind of settle into their roles. We're still we're still gonna have some nagging injuries. Everybody's shifted and we're, we're relying a lot of freshmen and sophomores who are doing a great job and learning mm -hmm. on the job and getting some experience. But um, you, you know, this is a challenging league and George Mason is a terrific program. Right, so what are the main things that you're going to try to focus on for this upcoming game? I think the toughest things for, for young players to do is to really defend at the college level. Um, you, you know, guys are blessed with some natural offensive talents, but defense is, is a combination of, of mental toughness, mental recognition, and, and, and physical strength. And those are things that I think that young players struggle with the most, and that's where we need to improve. Right. And then after that, you guys have three away games. You have a long stretch there. What are the things that you're going to need to focus on for those upcoming games? When you're on the road, it's all about composure, because uh, we'll go down to a terrific environment at VCU. They play a very up-tempo style of play. They try to press you and get you out of your rhythm and, and really cause some problems. And with a young team, that's a concern. So on the road, it's, I think the one word is composure. Okay, and anything in particular that you're going to work on in practice, free throws, field goals? Yeah, I, th I think you've got to continue to work on just fundamentals. Mm -hmm. uh, that's where the game starts, and, and particularly defensive fundamentals. And that, that takes time as guys' recognition gets better, as they're, uh, you, you know, they get an understanding of what we're trying to do in terms of a team concept, not just individual defense, but a team concept. Right. Well, thank you for your time, and good luck with your game on Wednesday. I appreciate it. Thank you very much.